Hi everyone, Craig Butt here, application scientist at SciX. Today we're gonna to talk about how you can power up your data review and data processing using the calculated columns and flagging rules within SciX OS. So if you're like me, you can spend a lot of time taking your data, exporting it into Excel, building a lot of sophisticated calculations, and then manually reviewing that data for things like uh, exceedances of action levels. Well, um, I'm here to show you how SACS OS can do that right within the results table, greatly speeding up your data review. Let me show you how. So if we look at our processing method under the calculated columns feature, I built a very simple calculation to calculate the wet weight in sample concentration. By that, I take our calculated concentration in the vial and apply correction factors for the sample mass and extract volume. From there, I can take that calculation that I've built and then build another custom flagging rule, in this case, to flag an action level. You can see what I've done here as I'm creating a flag for any samples that would exceed my action limit of 10. Then when we look within the results table, uh, we've got that custom column that I've built uh, for the sample concentration. And you can see here marked in red, we do have some exceedances, but we can take this very large results table and then apply that custom uh, filter and then look at everything that failed so we can uh, easily extract those samples and those pesticides that exceed our limit. So again, a uh, really great way to power up your data review and data processing using the uh, custom calculations and flagging rules within SciXOS. If you'd like a more in-depth demonstration of what I just showed you, please click the link below. Bye for now.